Trump will be the 45th president of the United I States. I pledge that I will be president for all Americans. A new president and a deeply divided country. The Donald Trump presidency is going to be anathema to at least part of the population and greatly welcomed by another part. And those two Americas have been at war with one another and they're likely to continue to be so. From Frontline's award-winning political team, the inside story of how we got here. The Republicans told the members, just say no. They thought they could ram this right through and to heck with conservatives. Through two terms of a Democratic president. They had decided we don't need to work with Republicans because we have super majorities on the Hill. And the civil war within the Republican Party. I had members who thought sitting down with the president was a big mistake. The searing events that drove the country further apart. The contradiction of this happening in the midst of a black presidency sharpened the irony and intensified the pain. One of my few regrets is my inability to reduce the polarization in our politics. One of his biggest disappointments was not being able to bridge that party divide, that toxicity in this town. And the voters' new choice for change. Donald Trump is the representation of the anti-Obama. He was speaking straight to tens of millions of Americans who think that they've been betrayed, not anger, betrayal by Washington. A Frontline special series, four hours over two nights, beginning January 17th.